Hello everybody, I'm back with yet another video. Have you figured it out yet? Have you noticed? Have you caught on? Have you seen the writings in the wall? Those of us who were fortunate, I guess, have noticed it long ago. Have you noticed that the government owns your church building? The government owns your church building. It's a 501c3. Now, I've been saying this forever. I'm not the only one. Obviously, I feel like we've been speaking to people who refuse to listen. As my brother would say, reminds me, Stephen, those who want to hear will. Those who don't, won't. And he's right. But it doesn't mean I'm not going to keep on talking. And those of those who know me well know that I can keep on talking. But let me make it perfectly clear. The church is owned by the government. The church shut down the church building. The government said, close your doors. They closed their doors. So, the godly church buildings bow down to man. Man is their authority. Interesting. Should not God be your authority? Your pastor doesn't think so. Your priest doesn't think so. Your pope don't think so. My friends... It's been clear for so long. How can you claim to answer to God only when you change, when you shut down the building that you say God wants there? If God wanted it there, and if God thinks... Sorry, I get a little upset about this sometimes. If God needed your building to be there it would still be open let this be a lesson from God stop falling back on the building and the ritual and the statues and all of that don't tell me well I mean Christianity just started way back then so they didn't have time to build these buildings and, and, and erect these uh, statues and no Sorry. Stop. That's absolutely nonsense. You have given authority to man above God. Now those of you who do so, then do so. But don't claim to be godly. Because you've chosen man's laws, man's authority. I'm not talking about speeding down the road and getting a speeding ticket. God is everywhere. No matter where you are, you can worship God. I've said it a hundred times if I haven't said it a hundred and one. You can worship God anywhere you are. You can be saved anywhere. The building is not the place that you need to be. It doesn't work that way. So, as the shutdown is going on in this quarantine, I hope you've noticed, and I'm not trying to be an angry person, but it's disturbing that so many have been misled, that you can only be close to God in a building. That's absolute nonsense. So now that you know that your government owns your church, you know, because it'll eventually be a one world government and a one religion? Hmm. You'll do what the government says. Don't do it. Don't do it. If you if you are really a born again and you are saved, don't do it. Don't go back to that building. Don't go back to that building. Create a network of, of brothers. 
Thank you for tuning into this video. I appreciate your time as always. God bless. I love you and have a beautiful day.